Department is reporting nearly 4,000 new infections across Michigan today and yesterday. An average of almost 2,000 cases per day. Tonight, 7 Action News reporter Faraz Javid shows us why teachers and professors unions at EMU are demanding more be done before Monday arrives. I'm doing everything I can. Uh, but, you know, the university needs to have our backs. EMU philosophy lecturer Jeremy Pru says the current safety guidelines are a patchwork of policies. For instance, students involved in athletics, theater or living in the dorms are required to get vaccinated while others are not. COVID doesn't care what your status on campus is. Uh, what we'd like to see is a broader vaccine mandate for that applies for everybody on campus. Meanwhile, EMU Vice President of Communications Walter Kraft says the university requires regular testing for unvaccinated students. Over the past 19 months of this pandemic, we have not experienced a single case where COVID has been transmitted inside a classroom. But even with the low transmission rate on campus, Jeremy believes the reason behind that was due to fewer people present across the university during the peak of the pandemic. We're, we're entering a different kind of situation on Monday. There's going to be thousands of people on campus. And we know, I mean, just look at the CDC transmission map. We know that in Washtenaw County, where we are, the transmission rate is high. If we see there are certain outbreak areas, then we can go after those areas and, and do contact tracing and pull those people off of campus or put them in isolation and make sure that they're not spreading. Um, the other thing that we have that's been very effective for us is we have a wastewater testing system. So from all the residence halls, we have monitors that we can detect COVID in the wastewater. As for the vibe on campus, with students already starting to move into dorms, one of the parents, Chris Maddox English, feels her son is in a safe place. I'm very comfortable with the guidelines they have in place. Um, I'm not hesitating at all to bring him here to live on campus and attend classes on campus. I think I'm pretty satisfied. I mean, I get to move in and a lot of people get to move in on campus and experience new things around campus. I feel like they're following very, uh, like, strict protocols so we can keep everyone safe and make sure everyone's like okay when all this hectic stuff is going on with COVID-19. Now an internal survey was conducted among the members of teachers and professors union here at EMU and Jeremy Prola says that a whopping 80 percent respondents are asking for stricter COVID-19 safety guidelines to be implemented across campus and are now asking to meet EMU officials to which Walter Kraft has responded that they're always open to discuss this topic further. From Ypsilanti, Faraz Javid, 7 Action News.